Well, now we are down to the last 16 in the Emirates FA Cup, the fifth round stage. Well, both these teams have played really well to get to this point and they'll be hoping to continue that form. Our match today is Wolverhampton Wanderers against Arsenal. Well, with an eye on Arsenal, we'll keep an eye on this player without a shadow of a doubt. Well, he's a crowd pleaser because when he gets the ball, you just don't know what's going to happen. So many possibilities with him in possession. And here is the way Wolves are set out for this vital fixture. We put it up as a 5-2-3, it could be 3-4-3, couldn't it, if the wide players get forward from the back? Yeah, I think it's one of those, it could be anything the manager wants it to be. He has got some very talented lads out there, though. Looking at the lineup, he's got all the components in place, hasn't he, the manager, for the pressing style of play that's been a feature of his team. Yep, and uh, many an opponent has found it difficult to cope with. If your touch isn't spot on against this aggressive type of closing down, you're going to lose it in dangerous areas. Arsenal more than useful at the moment, and they're hoping to get another victory here. They played very well last time out in that away victory against Manchester United. Yeah, nice and tight at the back in the 1-0 win. Clean sheets are great, and uh, the strikers can score. I think they will win today again. It's Michael Oliver, who is the referee here. FA Cup football, always a thrill. Fifth round tie here, and this is the action starting now. The referee blows his whistle. As always, wonderful atmosphere in this competition and uh, getting closer and closer to Wembley. He's coming forward with some danger. Hector Berry. Granani Chaka. Rose. Cutting in now. He's had a go here. Up for grabs here. And it will be their throw. Granani Chaka. Rose. A timely challenge. Here's Berin. Here's Berin. Danny Rose. Werner. Trying for Werner! That's a corner for Arsenal. Well, here comes the corner. Here's a chance! Comfortable stop, goalkeeper not troubled. Really getting at the opposition this far up the pitch now. And now the shot! Very good stop here. Corner for Arsenal.
corner played in. Defended well. Rose. Kanani Chaka. Could be dangerous. He's in. In really for what seemed a certain opening goal. Oh dear, oh dear. I think it's one of those that might play on his mind now for the rest of the match. Well, frustration from the manager, but by the same token, his team are playing well. They might have gone ahead there, but they'll get another chance. Goal news involving Watford. It's a second goal for Watford. It's been scored by Roberto Herrera. He arrived late in the box to nod home from close to the penalty spot. 22 minutes played, 2-0. Well, many thanks, Alan McAnally, keeping us up to date as usual. Jacka. Lang. Plenty of action at White Hart Lane today in front of our man Alan McInally. It's a goal for Tottenham Hotspur. It's been scored by Harry Kane. Was it a cross or was it a shot? He'll claim it was a shot, but a looping ball into the box finds its way into the back of the net. 26 minutes played, 1-0. Thanks, Alan. Well, he's cleared the danger. So we'll restart with a throw-in. Never quite as simple as you think to throw the ball to one of your teammates. Now this looks promising. And he's got the ball away from him with the tackle. Werner. Werner. the goalkeeper quick witted and quick in his movement too to intercept the attacking now this with a chance to go into the lead now oh the bar's still shaking here's a chance goalkeeper exposed and it's going to be a, a throw here. Rose. Werner. Well, that's very good defending. They had to get it right. And that defender did it superbly. Well, this attack... Probing pass. Werner. They scored. And they've gone into the lead. And undoubtedly deserved. They have been by far the superior side. And they really imposed their will on the opposition. Too good, really, for the defending. And the shot in the end far too good for the goalkeeper. There's almost an air of, well, we expected this when the goal was celebrated. Nothing too extravagant. I think they know they're the better side and they expect to win. No, I think they do. There's a certain swagger to their play uh, and inner self-belief. They know they're better and they're showing out on that pitch. Arsenal with the lead. Moving forward with some danger to the opposition now they're here. Werner. Well, it is a lead that Arsenal have got and they've worked hard to get it and they're still having to work hard to keep it.
Here's Bayerin. He's coming forward with some danger. Excellent vision. <laughs> Looked very good indeed, but the move has broken down. On to the attack now. Black. Well, this is a chance from the free kick. Cleared away by the defender. So it's 1-0 here as the half-time whistle goes. Well, the first half has given us a bit of a guide here as to what's going to happen, as to who's going to go through and who's going to go out. Yeah, I think deservedly lead, leading at the break, and uh, what a carrot to knock out their opponents from this tournament. They just keep it together, last 45. Cutting in now. He's had a go here. Up for grabs here. Now the shot. Very good stop here. now this with a chance to go into the lead now well this attack probing pass Werner. So the second half now, the ball is rolling in this fifth round tie in the Emirates FA Cup. Yeah, the first half was played at a good tempo, good pace, and you'd expect that to continue in the second half. Well, they're in a good position here. Goal news now from Watford. It's another goal for Watford, 49 minutes played. 4 0. Well, many thanks, Alan McAnally, keeping us up to date as usual. Werner. Here's Berin. Well, the player that we're featuring here has done well. He's certainly been an influence on this first half. Well, he played really well, didn't he? And he... Werner! It's in! Fine moment for them. They've got a firmer grip on the game now. They're two ahead. Well, he's doubled up here with his second goal, and he took it in excellent style, just like the first one. Well, let's take another look at the goal. Restarting at 2-0. Sancho on the move and able to cut out the pass. There's been a penalty involving Brighton. It's a penalty for Brighton and Hove Albion. A slight delay as the ref clears the defenders.
Come on then, is it a cool finish? Does he go for power? Oh, he never looked confident for me. Off the post, what a chance missed. 56 minutes played, it remains 1-0. Cheers, Alan. Granani Chaka. Rose. Danny Rose. Plenty of action at White Hart Lane today in front of our man Alan McInally. It's a goal for Fleetwood Town. 60 minutes played, 2-1. Thank you very much, Alan. Well, I like the look of this attack. Berisha. Giving the opposition a problem with their interpassing. Anticipated the direction of the pass and was able to intervene. Came in with a challenge. It's gone out for a throw. Well, they're going to make the change to the wide player, the winger. And looks to me as though he's done pretty well, Alan. What did you think? Yeah, good old-fashioned wing play. Had the better of his fallback for large parts of this match and uh, top performance. Lang. Goalkeeper. It's a corner. <laughs> corner swung in. I think the keeper had given it up, but not the defender. All about anticipation. He wasn't going to give it up. Got back just in time. Now we have a corner to come via that deflection. He's allowed uh, three substitutes and two of them coming on together here. He's put in the corner. Oh, that's good defending. He's awarded the free kick. On EA Sports very soon, the Champions Cup fixture. Arsenal, they'll be facing Napoli away from home. Yeah, high-quality fixture this one. There won't be much quarter given. News of a goal from Watford. It's another goal for Watford. 70 minutes played, 5-1. Oh, News again from Alan McAnally. Thanks, Alan. He's coming forward with some danger. The referee's given the free kick. Arsenal with the substitution. Very good distance to the clearance. Happy birthday to Nathan Walker, celebrating his birthday today from Dan and Lucy. Promising build-up until that challenge. Lang. Jaka. Danny Rose. Here they are, on the attack. That's nice, lovely passing, this. They're knocking. He's had a go here. Oh, that's such a classy goal. Well, how long's it been on? One or two minutes, I'm not sure, but he's marked his appearance here with a wonderful goal. Arsenal almost on easy street with that uh, latest goal, and very comfortable in the situation in the match. Well, it's just a question of being a professional now and not making any mistakes.
Well, it's great when a plan comes together and the manager doubly delighted with the way his team are playing. I have to say, it's so one-sided today, but all credit to the team that are racking up the goals. Arsenal's success in this match down to a consistent level of performance and it should provide them with a victory. Goal news from Watford. It's another goal for Watford. Nine minutes remain. Werner, they scored. And that's the third, the hat-trick. It's a day he'll never forget. Some players might switch off if they've scored a goal, even two goals in the game, but he's greedy for more, in the best way, I mean, and he's got a hat-trick. Yeah, he's been a danger from the start. His work rate, his, his runs off the ball have been top class. I don't think we expected this, such a one-sided affair, but look at the scoreline. Nothing so far in this game to surprise us, perhaps only the, the margin that they lead by. Yeah, it's not always easy coming into a game and everyone's expecting you to get a hat full, but they've kept their focus this side and uh, taken the chances nicely when they've cropped up. And now the shot, back out of the bar. Trying to pick out someone in the centre. Oh, he blocked it then. Good work, really, to read the intention of the pass. Well, this attack has got a bit of menace to it. They've lost the ball, and the counter-attack could be there. Werner. He's on the move all the time and makes lots of these interceptions. Quick-witted and quick in his movement, too, to intercept there. Oh, that's good defending. Three minutes from the referee by the fourth official. That's the decision regarding added time. That's an excellent cross. Not really away from the threat here. Good defensive clearance there. Werner. Played forward, a bit of menace in this attack. Gets his cross in. Cleared away, well away from goal. Referee says, that's that. What a brilliant performance from this fella. Well, he goes across and grabs the match ball from the ref, a hat-trick, and that's to be treasured by any player. A confirmation, then, of their success in this cup tie today. Well, they sailed close to the wind once or twice, some good saves from the keeper, but I think they just about deserve this win. Cutting in now. He's had a go here. Up for grabs here. Attacking now. This with a chance to go into the lead now. Well, this attack probing parts. Werner. The 
player that we're featuring here is... Well, he played really well, didn't he? And he... Werner! And a try one now. Quick reaction time here from the goalkeeper. Nice, oh, lovely passing this. They're knocking. He's had a go here. Watford. It's another goal for Watford. Nine minutes remain. Werner. 